Come on and give the Lord some praise. That God said Jesus was fixing.
Michelle did. Quite. As, you, know, you may be seated. God bless you. My darling wife, Sister Doris, is going to come and share a word with us. The apple of my eye. The kisses of my pie. The coffee of my cream. And still the young lady of my dream. Come on, Sister Doris. God bless As the Lord directs you, speak for him. Be 
neighbor is we got to have a, the whole armor of God. The Philistine with his shield bearer in front of him uh -huh. kept coming closer to David. Uh -huh. He looked David over and saw that he was only a boy. Uh -huh. Ruddy and handsome and he despised him. Uh -huh. He said to David, am I a dog uh -huh. Uh -huh. that you come at me with sticks? Uh -huh, and the uh -huh. Philistine cursed David by his guards. Yes. Come here, he uh -huh. said, uh -huh. and I'll give your flesh to the birds of the air right. and the beasts of the field. Yes. David said to the Philistine, uh -huh. you come against me with sword and spear yeah, yeah. and javelin, yeah. but I come against you in the name of the Lord. Yeah. Yeah. All right to the God of the Lord. Lord have mercy. As he had got his 
this door. And it's slick. And it hit it right there. And it fell there. And it went out. And cut his head off. And walked away with it on the chart. But you see, God will fight your mouth if you just keep still. If you just let go and let God, he will do his part. I want to say to you, everybody's going through some kind of battle. You may not be fighting a child, but somebody's going through some kind of battle. Somebody's got a hell of a battle, and they're fighting with it right now. Somebody got a sinus battle, they're fighting with it right now. Some got a social battle, they fight with somebody that's battling them right now. Even in the family, in the home, in the community. And some, maybe somebody across town or out of town. You got a battle going on. Somebody else got a battle. They get ready to go to court. Because they get ready to fight the battle in the courthouse, in the courtroom. Lord have mercy. But you don't you know the Lord said, I'll fight your battle. I want you to know that. Vengeance is mine. Don't you try to get evil. You've been trying to solve the problem all the time. What kind of progress have you made? Are you dressed for success? Are you dressed for the battle? I don't know about you, but I'm glad. I'm glad. The Lord said, nothing can wash away all my sin. Nothing. But the blood of Jesus. Nothing can make me whole again. Nothing but the blood of Jesus. When the blood of Jesus gets a hold of you and wash your sins away. And the Lord revealed the Apostle Paul. He said, Therefore, whosoever shall confess Jesus with their mouth, believe Jesus in their heart, and don't doubt him in their mind. They shall be saved. I say to you, confess Jesus. Right now. Confess Jesus. Right now. And say in your heart, say it. Get behind me. For I'm decided to follow Jesus. Because I'm going to be dressed for success. I'm going to be dressed for the job. And when I go with Jesus, it's going to be all right. Because you see, when you get dressed right, you stop giving people a piece of your mind. What I'm going to do, I'm going to give you a word from the Lord. The Lord says, tell them, according to St. Matthew 4 and 4, say, man shall not live by bread alone, but by any word that proceeded out of the mouth of God. Don't you fight your battle yourself. Give the word, and the word will call you to be victorious. I say to you, Jesus died on the cross, so nobody would be lost. I thank God. I thank God. I thank God. I'm saved, justified, satisfied, sanctified, purified, and I'm dressed. Most of God bless you. God bless you.